Narrated by Abu Musa We were with the Prophet peace be upon him on a journey, and whenever we ascended a high place, we used to say, Allahu Akbar. The Prophet peace be upon him said, Don't trouble yourselves too much. You are not calling a deaf or an absent person, but you are calling one who hears, sees, and is very near. Then he came to me while I was saying in my heart, La hala wala kumta illa billah, there is neither might nor power but with Allah. He said, to me, O Abdullah bin Kais. Say, La hala wala kawaita illa billah, there is neither might nor power but with Allah, for it is one of the treasures of paradise. Or said, Shall I tell you of it? Narrated by Abdullah bin Amor. Abu Bakr as Siddiq said to the Prophet peace be upon him O Allah's messenger peace be upon him. Teach me an invocation with which I may invoke Allah in my prayers. The Prophet peace be upon him said, Say, O Allah. I have wronged my soul very much, oppressed myself, and none forgives the sins but you, so please bestow your forgiveness upon me. No doubt, you are the oft-forgiving, most merciful. Narrated by Aisha. The Prophet peace be upon him said, Gabriel called me and said, Allah has heard the statement of your people and what they replied to you. Narrated by Jabir bin Abdullah. As Salami, Allah's messenger peace be upon him used to teach his companions to perform the prayer of Istikara for each and every matter just as he used to teach them the surahs from the Quran he used to say, if any one of you intends to do something, he should offer a two rack at prayer other than the compulsory prayers, and after finishing it, he should say, O oh Allah, I consult you, for you have all knowledge, and appeal to you to support me with your power and ask for your bounty, for you are able to do things while I am not, and you know while I do not, and you are the knower of the unseen. O oh Allah if you know it this matter, name your matter, is good for me both at present and in the future, or in my religion, in my this life and in the hereafter, then fulfill it for me and make it easy for me, and then bestow your blessings on me in that matter. O oh Allah! If you know that this matter is not good for me in my religion, in my this life and in my coming hereafter, or at present or in the future, then divert me from it and choose for me what is good wherever it may be, and make me be pleased with it.